morning guys so it is actually not morning it is almost four o'clock in the afternoon but um i woke up i slept in because of the i'm i'm afraid this is gonna fall i have this balance on chip cam but it's like moving anyway so i slept in because i was quite tired from the raise game last night but that was an awesome game the best game I have ever been to. They like blew the other team out of the water and it was amazing. So sorry if you're a Twins fan. That's probably not amazing, but it was amazing as a race fan. Um, so the first thing I did this morning was I paid off the last excursion um, for our cruise that like two weeks from today I'll be in Miami. So I paid that off. And when I clicked that and I was done, I was like, yes, like this has been the accumulation of six months I was making payments and, um, you know, paying these excursions and the cruise itself and all this. And so when I clicked that and I paid that off, I was like, everything is paid for. The flight is paid for. The cruise is paid for. The excursions are paid for. And I was so excited. I am so excited. Like two weeks from now, I will be in Miami getting ready to go to the port tomorrow. So I am so excited. But, um, so the excursions that we picked out are, um... In Belize, we're doing Mayan ruins. It's like this eight hour uh, exploring like these Mayan ruins and climbing up them. And then, um, sorry, um, I was pulling up the stuff on my phone because I always forget the names of the islands that we're going to. I remember Belize and Cosmo, but that's probably because I've been there before. So anyway, in Belize, we're doing the um, Mayan ruins. And then in Grand Cayman, we're doing this thing where we're swimming with starfish and stingrays and there's like a lunch and it's like a sandbar and it is amazing sounds amazing um in mahogany bay we're doing this thing i'm really excited about this because i love monkeys and like little monkeys and we're doing this thing where we are it's called pirates birds and monkeys of the caribbean and so there's um it's where these pirates used to be and there's parrots and stuff but then my favorite part of this is going to be there's capuchin monkeys that are like really friendly and they come down and they sit on your shoulders um it's this thing like oh my gosh i cannot wait for that but like that is so cute and i will be vlogging all this just so you know so maybe you guys will see a capuchin monkey in my vlog um and then in cozumel we are swimming with dolphins we we're originally going to do something else because uh, my sister was doing a dolphin swim, but I swam with dolphins on my Make-A-Wish back in uh, 2009, 10 years ago. Um, but the one that we were going to do sold out, so we are all doing it together. Um, we're going to go swim with dolphins in Cosmo. So that's all really exciting. I am so excited for this cruise. Um, but yeah, so that's what I did first thing this morning. And then uh, just did my normal treatments and meds and all that. And... Then it was kind of interesting when we went to go take the dogs out to potty, we've been really dry. Um, like, we haven't had rain since, like, before April 12th, I think. Like, since the beginning to middle of April, we have not had any rain, and parts of Upper Florida are actually in a drought already, and, which is like the complete opposite of where I'm flying to. You know, Little Rock's having this historic flooding of the river, and then we're in a drought here in Florida. Like, it's crazy. But, um, <clears throat> like, our grass is dying, trees are losing leaves, this is not normal. And, uh, we had a letter, um, on our, like, at our doorstep, and it was this thing saying people need to be careful with their cigarettes. Now, obviously, that doesn't apply to us because nobody in my house smokes, but, um, the interesting thing of that was people need to be careful with their cigarettes because people have been unintentionally setting their patios and balconies and fences on fire. So I was like... <laughs> Uh, <laughs> <coughs> 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 what? <laughs> like, the letters stated that somebody, uh, one of the people, like, set their fence on fire and it spread to the neighbor's fence, and I was like, well, that's nice. So, I don't know. I, it was just, like, explaining the rules of what to do and, like, with grills and stuff, but I was just like, okay. People have been setting their patios on fire. I mean, not purposely, but that's good to know. I'm glad our neighbor didn't set their patio on fire. So anyway, um, <clears throat> so that was this morning. Um, and uh, pretty pretty interesting morning. Uh, but yeah, so now I'm just kind of relaxing. I am going to go for a run tomorrow, I think. Just an easy quarter. The three-fourths of a mile really knocked my ankle out a lot more than I expected it to because my ankle's been pretty much good for 
you know, the past two or three months, I don't really think about it. And so I think I'm just gonna try and do an easy quarter to kind of keep up the fitness a little bit, but not make my ankle, ankle angry at me again because it's finally stopped being angry at me. So anyway, that's all I got for now. So hope you guys are having a good day as well and I'll see you guys in a little while. Guys, so I just went for a short little walk with Panda. Panda, get up, get out, leave it. Stop eating, stop, stop. I just, he's being something else today, y'all. But um, I just went for a little walk with him. He's quite tired because it's like 91 degrees outside, but it worked. You gonna get your toy? You gonna get your toy? No, we're gonna go over there, okay. So I went in earlier than I normally do. Um, normally I would have waited till almost dark, but I just didn't want to go up that late because I kind of wanted to sit in tonight. So we went out a little bit early. <laughs> What's wrong with you, Ninja? <laughs> okay, behave. Um, so now I am making some dinner, just making some spaghetti, uh, something quick and easy. And um, yeah, then I'm just gonna chill while that cooks. But uh, anyway, uh, my ankle feels pretty good now. I was kind of wanting to test it out as well because like I said, I want to run to our panda. Don't bother the cat. Hang on a moment. Sorry, I had to take care of a uh, cat situation. He was chasing her and she was not very happy about it. Um, but anyway, so, uh, no, I have to zoom down. Uh, zoom out. No, no, zoom, in, zoom out. Thank you. So anyway, I was kind of wanting to test my ankle because I want to, um, go for a run tomorrow and everything felt a okay. I didn't have any pain. So I think I'm good for my run tomorrow. So just gonna cook dinner. I don't really recommend standing over a hot stove after walking in 99 degree weather either, but it's Florida. What can you do? So <laughs> just gonna cook some dinner and, uh, yeah, see you guys in a little while. While well, I'm waiting for that to boil, I also have to tell you guys that I realized something quite crazy today. So I booked my other flights for um, for when I go back for my to my dental appointment and my pulmonary appointment at the end of June and beginning of July. And so I booked a flight for June 27th and then through July 17th. That's not the crazy part. The crazy part is I realized I will literally be flying every single week in June. Like. There will not be a week in June where I don't fly, which is kind of exciting for me who loves flying, but also a little bit intimidating, like how tired am I gonna get of flying? Um, Cause I fly on Tuesday, June 4th, fly back to Tampa June 9th. Um, I fly out of Tampa to Fort Lauderdale on the 14th, fly back from Fort Lauderdale to Tampa, this is for the cruise, um, on June 21st, I believe, June 21st, June 22nd, one of those. And then I fly, from back to Tampa from Little Rock to uh, or back to Little Rock anyway from uh, on June the 27th so there will literally not be a, a week this week where I'm not flying a week this month where I'm not flying which is <coughs> suffice to say I'm really glad I'm not scared of flying anymore or it would be setting up to be a pretty terrifying month. So, um, but yeah, I just found that crazy because like I've been flying every month for about a year, um, give or take a couple of months and it's like it's gotten so used to oh, I have one flight a month and now it's like oh I have one flight a week. So it's, uh, it's pretty crazy. I mean the the cruise flights, uh, the Tampa to Fort Lauderdale are only like 45 minutes and they're non-stop so that's not like a humongous amount of time uh, on the plane or the airport or whatever, but um, it's pretty pretty insane. So I'm kind of looking forward to it, kind of not. I don't know. It's gonna be a crazy month. Um, flying every week, got a cruise in the middle of it. <laughs> so uh, got an appointment coming up next week. It's gonna be June's gonna be uh, uh, a very busy month, I think. <laughs> but hey guys, I'm gonna go ahead and say good night. Dinner is done. I sprinkled a little cheese on top of mine because let's be honest, cheese makes everything better. And uh, I'm gonna go ahead and upload this while I eat that. Um, since it is actually seven o'clock, today went by fast. I got up at like nine something and I can't believe it's already seven o'clock. But anyway, yeah, just gonna eat some dinner, upload this uh, in a little bit, do my treatment and just kinda get everything done a little bit early tonight and uh, enjoy just being able to relax the rest of the night and not really have to worry about doing anything. So, 
Gonna eat that. Obviously gonna take some enzymes because if I ate that whole bowl of spaghetti without it, I wouldn't be having free time tonight. I'd be on the toilet. <laughs> Let's be completely honest. See off live here. Um, and I'm gonna upload this. So thank you guys so much for coming along on my day today. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good night.